Seniors, welcome to your class meeting, class of 2019. Give it up for yourselves a little bit here. All right. So, if you have not figured out what we're going to be talking about today, if you don't remember me, my name's Jeff with Johnson's. I met with you guys way back freshman year when we talked about class rings and class jewelry, things like that. Today, we're talking about graduation, though. All right, it's going to be coming up fast. I know it's still only October. But it's going to be coming up before you know it because senior year, if you haven't figured it out yet, it's going to be the most fun year you have in high school. You're going to have, you know, Thanksgiving break's going to be coming up, Christmas break, and I'm sure everybody's looking forward to spring break coming up after that. And then before you know it, it's graduation time. All right, so we're going to be placing our orders for the cap and gowns next week during lunch at school. All right, so I'm going to walk you through everything that's going to be available because it's going to be more than just cap and gowns. That's obviously the main thing, um, but it's going to be a big process. The first thing I'm going to talk about is before we leave here, everybody's going to grab one of these packets. I'll get them passed out before you leave because they're going to have your order forms in there um, to order these things. You're going to see two different order forms in the packets. One's going to look like this. It's a front and back order form. It's blue and white. This has packages on the front that you can order. On the back, it's everything individually, a la carte. So if you don't want to do a package, you just want to kind of pick and choose certain things, you can do so on this order form right here. All right? So on this one also, we ask you for your height and weight. That's how we know what size cap and gown to get you. We also ask you for an email address. That's so we can send you home a receipt. It's not so we can spam you a bunch of different things. It's just so we can confirm your order with you and you know what that is. There's also going, to, also going to be a second order form in there that's going to be on an orange sheet of paper. All right, this one's the Marauder package. I do this one custom just for your school. I try and make this as easy as possible. So if you don't have to fill out both of them, you just kind of pick and choose which order form you want to do. But this, think of this kind of as like a one-stop shop. If you fill this one out, you know you're good. You know everything you need for graduation is taken care of. All right, so why this is the most popular one is because we put things in there that a lot of the parents want, like graduation announcements, which I'll go over there in a second. Then it's got some things that a lot of the seniors like to order, like some extra t-shirts, an extra tassel for your car or something like that. And then obviously your cap and gown is going to be in this one as well. All right. So I talked about next week, Tuesday and, and Wednesday. Next week is when we're doing this in the cafeteria at lunchtime, which I talked about. You're going to see right here it says $50 or payment in full. So what that means is if your order comes to more than $50, so you're going to get like a hoodie and some other things, you can make a $50 deposit, still get those items that you ordered, so we'll make sure you get everything, but you can make payments on it all the way until the end of the year. Payment, you can pay in full if you want, just be done with it, but also if your order comes to less than $50, then you just pay for it. So you obviously don't need to give me $50 if your order is only $37, okay? So, graduation announcements. Some seniors know what these are, some do not. I know when I was sitting in your seat, I had no clue what these were. These are the formal way that you announce graduation. So I like to tell people, think of it like a wedding. You wouldn't just, you know, send out a tweet or send out an Instagram post saying, hey, I'm getting married, come to my wedding. Some people might, but normally you send out a formal invitation, a formal way to do that. So the graduation is the exact same way, all right? More often than not, a lot of you guys will be having graduation parties and you're gonna be putting uh, your graduation invites right in, for the party right inside the announcements. Um, I like to tell people if you have, you know, friends, families, relatives, things like that, they're expecting one of these because more times than not, they're going to be coming to that graduation party with usually a nice, uh, a nice gift for you. More often than not, it's it's a check or some type of money um, that they're going to give you, and then you send them a thank you card. It's just kind of the tradition of how how that goes. All right. So that's the graduation announcements. Obviously, yours are custom to Carlson High School, and it has everything related to Carlson's graduation in there. Now, when you guys were underclassmen, you might have seen some of the senior apparel. I like to put this up there just so you can kind of see what some of the items are for the class of 19. So you can see what those are with hoodies and sweatpants and t-shirts and, you know, all types of things. Beanies, whatever, whatever you want. So, there's going to be a brochure in the packets that I gave you that has pictures of all these too, in case you forget what they look like, what they're going to be on there. Also, what's been very popular is our senior socks. And the reason, did you guys have... Mike, Mike Smith, I know, came to the school two years ago that works with us at Johnson's. Were you guys at the assembly with him? Yeah, yeah you guys remember him? So, he's, he's one of our big partners at, uh, at Johnson's, the things we do. And if you know a little bit about his story, he's done some really good things with nonprofit and helping out the homeless. So when you buy a pair of socks, you obviously get one pair and then we donate another pair to his Skate for Change chapter, which I'll give you kind of a little bit of background on. 
2010, my friends and I started Skate for Change because we saw a need in our community and we wanted to fix it. Socks are the most requested, least donated item in shelters. And we met a need by skating around, not just handing out socks, but handing out other things like water and hygiene and food. Today, Skate for Change has grown into a massive program that is seen in hundreds of chapters of kids skating around the communities. Places like Grand Rapids, Seattle, Los Angeles, Chico, and DC. I am so stoked to announce this fall that Skate for Change is partnering with Jostens to help make giving easier for you. This fall, when you buy a pair of Jostens Stand for Something socks, Jostens will donate a pair to Skate for Change, and they will be handed out through chapters in 34 cities across the globe. Already this year, Skate for Change chapters have handed out close to 5,000 pairs of socks, and the goal for this upcoming school year is to put socks on the feet of 10,000 people. Help us reach that goal today. This is your time to make a difference. This is your time to speak for the side and stand for the broken. Thank you for your support. All right, so that, that's just a, uh, that's a cool thing we do with Mike. Like I said, you don't have to do that. If you want to do it, though, just know one of the other pairs is going to get donated to, to the homeless. So, and it's cool that he's got one of the chapters here right in Michigan for us. But, obviously, cap and gown now is another important thing. So, if you guys are not aware, all the males wear blue and all the females wear uh, white. All the tassels are blue and white and then everybody has a 19 on their tassel. So if you're gonna be borrowing a capping on, that's more than okay, but you have to make sure you still get the tassel because it's gonna have your year date on there, all right? I talked about height and weight for your capping on, so on the order form, it's, it's very important you make sure you don't skip that part. Nobody's gonna see it, it's totally confidential. Just make sure it's accurate so we can make sure your capping on fits you properly. Your head size, the caps are all one size fits all, so you don't have to worry about letting us know what size your head is or anything like that. All right, and then every, this is another big question I get is, does a tassel come with my cap and gown? Yes, every, every cap and gown unit comes with a tassel. All right, the other thing I wanna mention that I make sure is very clear is, when you place your order, if you're just ordering a cap and gown, you're gonna see on the order form there's a 9.95 shipping and handling fee. You do not have to pay that if you're just getting a cap and gown. All right, it's 34.95, you do have to add tax, that's just the state of Michigan and then it ends up being $37.05, all right? So you don't have to pay shipping and handling if you're just getting a cap and gown, all right? Now, this is the 19 right here, this one with my little laser pointers on. That's the one that comes with every cap and gown. If you want an extra tassel on order day, I will get you, when you purchase it at order day at school, I hand it to you right on the spot next week, all right? So some people like to get the bling down one, some people like the vertical one, we have a Marauder ship that we do for your custom school mascot tassel. And you can also see we got black uh, tassels. There's even camouflage tassels. So the big thing is you'll get those on order day. If you see somebody walking around with a tassel before the end of the year when we pass out the cap and gowns, that's why. It's because they just ordered an extra one. It's not that we forgot to give you yours. It's just like I said, people want, people want them now to have in their car and things like that. All right? So... All these things, most of these things I talked about is going to be in that Marauder package, like if that's the route you choose to go. Like I said, if not, you can also fill out the other order form. Class jewelry, like I said, we talked about that when you guys were freshmen. If there was something wrong with yours, but you needed it fixed or something like that, we can do that for you. If you didn't order one, it's very easy to do. You can kind of see the steps right up here. You just go to jostens.com, you fill out the, uh, you design it right online, and when you're done, you're going to hit print, and it prints your order form out for you. The promotion we do as seniors is if you do order your class jewelry as a senior, you get your cap and gown for free. So that's something we like to do to make sure that we can we can hook you guys up for, for a promotion senior year. We do different ones every year. Another question I get is, well, if I order my freshman year, can I get my cap and gown free this year? Unfortunately, the answer is no, because we do different promotions for different times. So you gotta order it your senior year. All right, so you can see right here what you do. And obviously you just hit continue order form, you print it out right there, bring it in next week, all right? So, if you have yours and something's wrong with it, bring it in, it's always free to resize and clean them, do whatever, if you wanna change something on it, we can change it, it's absolutely free to do that, um, that's no problem. As far as payments go, you can pay any way you want, check, cash, money orders, credit cards, whatever you guys wanna do is perfectly okay, but just remember to do it Tuesday and Wednesday at school, all right? The last thing I'll cover is, if you can't make it next week, say you're in Vogue or something like that, you're not gonna be at lunches, you can always turn your order in early to Miss Wilson in the office and I'll pick it up from her on my way to the lunchroom next week. Um, you can always order online. 
The big difference between ordering online versus ordering in school is when you order online, your items are going to get shipped home to you, except the capping out and the announcements. Those still get delivered at school in the springtime. But the, is the tassels. So when you order on at school, we're gonna if you get clothing and things like that, most of that stuff I'm gonna give you, like I said, right at school, tassels, clothing, all that. When you order online, look, it's shipped home, except for your tassel. So if you order an extra tassel online, it's gonna get packed in with your cap and gown and you won't get it until the end of the year. So if you really want an extra tassel and you're gonna order online, I would say do that part at school or do that by coming to our office if you can't make it at school and then everything else you'll, you're totally fine to do online stuff. All right, covered a lot of things pretty quickly. I wanted to make sure we get this kind of done for you guys, but does anybody have any questions about how you do any of this stuff? All right, it's pretty easy, it's pretty, uh, pretty straightforward, but if you think of something, our phone number is right on the packet, you can call us, we can do that. Um, what I'm gonna do now is pass out the packets, make sure everybody has one. Maybe if I could have some of you got people in the front row to help me out get these and we can get everybody through this pretty quick. You have a question? Yeah, if you're Vogue and you gotta leave, come up right now and grab a packet. You can get out of here. Otherwise, we'll get these passed out. And then, what time do you, what t what time do you guys have until? So if we have time, I could play a game where we give away a free cap and gown. Nine minutes? All right, we can do it real quick then. So we'll pass these out. Maybe if you, if you, everybody in the front row would want to come up and let me pass these out, we can play a game where we give away a free cap and gown real quick. Thank you. Uh, you guys